Unveiling the charm, nestled in the pines. Hello, everyone. Today, we're diving into a picturesque phrase that paints a vivid picture in just a few words, nestled in the pines. This expression is not just about the physical location but also evokes a feeling of tranquility and harmony with nature. Let's explore what makes this phrase so special and how you can use it in your English conversations and writings. Nestled is a verb that describes something or someone being comfortably settled or tucked into a safe or cozy space. It suggests a sense of comfort, protection, and care. When we think of something being nestled, we imagine it being surrounded and held gently, like a bird in its nest. The word in is a preposition that indicates location or position. It tells us where something is nestled. The pines refers to a group of pine trees, which are evergreen trees known for their long, needle-like leaves. Pine trees are often associated with wilderness, natural beauty, and a serene atmosphere. They can create a picturesque scene, especially when covering large areas of forest. Together, nestled in the pines conveys an image of something being cozily tucked away amidst pine trees, suggesting a serene, picturesque, and somewhat secluded setting. This phrase can be used to describe homes, cabins, villages, or any place that is situated in such a peaceful and natural environment. When we use the phrase, nestled in the pines, we're not just talking about a location. We're also conveying a feeling of peace, tranquility, and being close to nature. This expression can evoke a sense of escape from the hustle and bustle of everyday life, offering a tranquil retreat to those who seek solace in nature's lap. This phrase is often used in literature, poetry, and real estate to describe settings that are not only beautiful but also have a calming effect on the mind and soul. It's a way to highlight the natural beauty of a place and its ability to provide a peaceful refuge. Incorporating nestled in the pines into your language can add a layer of vivid imagery and emotion to your communication. Here are a few examples of how it can be used. Describing a dream home. I've always dreamed of a small cottage nestled in the pines where I can enjoy the quiet of nature. Setting the scene in a story. The old cabin nestled in the pines at the edge of the lake held secrets of its own Expressing a desire for escape. I long for a weekend getaway nestled in the pines, away from the noise of the city. We hope this exploration of nestled in the pines has not only taught you the meaning behind the words but also how to use this beautiful phrase to add depth and imagery to your English. It's phrases like these that enrich our language and imagination, connecting us more deeply with the world around us. Thank you for joining us today, and we look forward to sharing more insights into the English language with you in our future videos.